All right, guys, big episode. One night with Steiny, Emily Willis, and Trevor Wallace at the same time. Episode is brought to you by Prize Pick, my favorite sports app. I'm coming off the biggest win I've ever had 3K to win 15K. I was all in on Dak Prescott, all in on Kyler Murray, who's back for the season. This week, I'm going to give you guys the lock. It's Jalen Hurts more than half a touchdown. I promise you he's gonna score. That's the game of the week. Eagles Chiefs, I'm all in on Jalen Hurts. More for him on everything. Go download Price Picks right now. They're gonna match your deposit up to $100. Let's get into the episode. Stan, you whipping in a Jeep? Oh, it's a rental. Oh, but like a big flag. mine's in the oh, shop. nice. What's in the shop? <clears throat> uh, Tesla. In the shop, so I have a temporary Jeep right now. What'd you whip here? Tesla. <sighs> Which model? The three. The three? The version. All right, guys. We have a new episode, One Night with Steiny. Uh, That's really... your intro? Yeah. What? You're <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. cut off my intro. No, I'm, my bad. My bad. Why? Would Sorry. you have done it differently? I don't understand. I would have done it naked. Okay. Well, I'm going to do it close for this. Uh, Sorry, dude. I've just been here for like four hours. No, you're good. All right. One Night with Steiny, we have Trevor Wallace, Emily Willis. Let's go, baby. I like to put random groups together. I don't think it's random. We shot a sketch together. Oh, yeah. I know. Not like that, but. No, I've seen it. Not, I watched not it that today. website. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, on YouTube, not the one with the P. What What's the title of that sketch? I think it's just like recognizing your p- in public. Yeah. Yeah. Was that like the way that he went about it? Is that usually how it goes down? I damned him. No, I mean like when that happens. Oh, like is oh. that true <laughs> when, when people, people like, recognize see you? you? Like, is that a pretty good? Um, actually, no. I, I recently and always, I always have really good experiences. I haven't had very negative like. Anybody like come up at me or talk to me in a negative light or I've ever felt like weird. The only time that something weird happened is was at the staples. I was at a staples getting boxes because I was moving and this guy asked me for a photo and I was just really going through it and I it was the one time I was like I'm just trying to get boxes and leave, you know? Yeah. And he got upset and he said you shouldn't be so entitled. And I think that's the only negative time I've ever had. But do well, like how do they approach her? Like, oh Emily, or like... usually they're like Emily, I love you. Like, can I get a photo? Yeah. And I... and I'm always just like, yeah. There's a lot of dudes like double taking. Like, oh oh, I think it'd be funny that, if like a, a, a guy with a, his girlfriend like double takes and she's like, who's that? And he's like, ah. Uh, <laughs> uh, there has uh, been times that people are like, school. oh, are, are you Emily Willis? And like, yeah. Has has that happened when they've been with their girls? That's when you're like, yo, you go, you go. She plays in the WNBA, babe. Yeah, yeah. She's my favorite. uh, Honestly, I don't think so. I don't think I've had a lot of couples come up to me. I've had a lot of girls come up to me though. Oh Oh, yeah, and I like that. That's fun. I love it when girls when I when I when I meet the girls. What's the difference in that encounter? Just because it's like I don't know. Girls being girls. Yeah. Just like, hey, I love you. I want a photo. Hey, like, yeah, it's just a little bit more like friendlier. Um, Has anybody ever been like, my son loves you? Of age, she's eighteen. No, not yet. Really, that'd be so funny. Do my stuff. Someone loves you. If that hasn't happened, that would that will be really happen. funny. Though. That would <laughs> That's be really a good funny. strategy. Because I've had, you would do, I've like. had parents come to my show and they're like, "Oh, my son was old enough to come to the show. Can you like talk shit to him on a video real quick?" Or like FaceTime him and I like, "But like, yeah, flip off my son." I'm like, "No." Yeah. But also, fuck you, Tanner. Yeah. <laughs> no, but um, I feel like a lot of these guys like, do they assume like they, they have a chance or like they want to take you out type thing? Like, is there an assumption there? Um, Cause I would probably assume that myself. I, uh, I don't know if that's fucked up or not. I don't know. I, maybe on my like OF yeah. or something. I think so. I don't know. I don't think. Like, so. have any has any fan ever asked you out? Oh yeah, all the time. He's okay. about to ask okay. you out right now. No, this, is what, this is what <laughs> he's yet. gearing up for. Yeah. Is this you shooting a oh, shot? Yeah. No, not a yet. A podcast host ever like asked you out? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, no, I feel like a lot of people just have that assumption. Like, yo, like I feel. Like, oh, for sure. I yeah, think that which is disrespectful. Only because like. I mean, there was that whole era where I was tweeting on Twitter, like, crazy shit, and, like... Oh, I must have missed that. What happened? Just crazy shit? Well, it's just, like... uh, Yeah, we don't have to... For a while, my Twitter was super kinky, and... I mean, it still is, but, like... Like, on some Kanye shit, or... Filtered. And so yeah. I think that sometimes you like assume, and also because of what I do, like, oh. they're like, so she just said that she's horny, and she wants to get in the... That Therefore, that means when I see her, like... 
she's ready for she's it. You know what right. I mean? Yeah. So I it, so there's times that yeah, I've definitely felt that. Well, it's the same way when people see you, they probably want to like shotgun a happy dad. Dude, fucking you, dude, you're always drunk, aren't you? I've actually or like had that Charlie. Happen. Now you're gonna be funny. Yeah, do it now. Do the thing. Yeah. yeah. I like I'll yell in all my what. videos, so people expect me to be yelling in yeah, real life. Yeah. What's yours like? And then I'll well, go it's just mine. like people will be like uh, the, like the bang energy. Like I did a sketch on that years ago. Yeah. So people would come at me and I'm yelling that whole video. People would come at me with like big energy. I'm like, oh, dude, I'm like not. I'm like a cat at heart. Like I'm just reserved. I like to be by myself and be quiet. But like, yeah, you know. So it's a lot of that. Or White Claw was big. So people at the airport six a.m. like, dude, fucking drink a White Claw yeah, with yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, dude, you're the pilot. <laughs> yeah, I'm supposed to be flying this thing. Yeah, no, I've not had that with a pilot, but I've had that with a kid who like pressed me on a layover and was like, yo, let's take shots right now. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, how long was your layover, dude? It was the worst experience I've ever had. Like oh New York, God. and I was supposed to go to Dallas, and we had to emergency land in Austin. To take shots. Oh, no. no, just for the plane. Yeah. And I sat in there and I was so like pissed off. It was like midnight. And this kid just comes up to me and he's like, let's take shots, bro. And I'm like, dude, yeah. I, I appreciate the love. I can't do it. And he's like, I'm telling all my friends that you're. <laughs> Isn't that oh crazy? My God. He can get you to do anything. I was like, he dude, starts unzipping his pants. Point. He's like, I'll tell your friends you're a like, bitch, dude. There. But he, he like, the layover was like three hours. So I had to deal with him like three <sighs> or four times. Like he kept cha like taking rounds, like yeah. ready to go or not. Damn, and then he dude. always had to bring up like, tell my friends you're, a f bro. Yeah, I was like, dude, I'll I'll take it, fuck it. But now he told his friends you're a legend. For, for what for turning him down? No. Oh, did you turn him down? Yeah, I couldn't. Oh, do it. Dude, oh, you're you a didn't pussy, do it. Dude. Yeah. Oh man, am I? <laughs> no, no, I'm I'm kidding. I would have. I would have. I would have. I couldn't him down do too. it. Like taking shots. I don't know. Just well, it just depends. Well, like, yeah, I guess. Just some random dude that I'm gonna know for thirty minutes and get hammered with. Like, like if you were landing in Vegas, sure. But like if you're just like going, I was just landing to go to bed. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah, no. yeah. It's it's tough when they're filming. I've had somebody walk up with a shot in their hand, and they're already filming, like walking up to me. And I'm like, <laughs> yeah. then I'm like, oh, I'll, I'll, dude, I could be sober for seven years. I'll take that shot. Yeah. Well, at that point, you've no you're choice. On camera, yeah. You're like, That's oh, wow. Thank you so much. Alcohol. Woo. Has that happened to you? Where someone approaches you while filming? Or like people take. I like, maybe at like AVNs, maybe at the AVNs and stuff. Yeah. But not not like in. Like, like I went to the AVNs like... last year. It's just crazy. Oh, you were right. Yeah, it's just what crazy. did you think about it? I thought it was so like normal. First of all, did I was you like, stay for the awards? No, that was Sunday. We didn't. Okay. But we were. It, the convention is so like bright. Like it feels like very like work like corporate. -y. For sure. I didn't see one pair of tits. I actually saw one. Kendra's. She flashed me. It was pretty cool. This She's a Vegas, nice lady. Right? Vegas. Yeah. But like I saw a dude on a leash. That was cool. I saw yeah. a guy with oh, binoculars yeah. and a ponytail. Yeah. The, like the actual convention Indoors. itself. I feel like. Bro, it's bird watching. Like, you get to see a lot of. A lot of playful kinky stuff. What, what what's what's the binoculars and the significance so, of the ponytail? I don't. He's he wants to see some HD tits. This guy was uh, on the, the convention the center. You said what? Is he must have been in the risers. No, he was he was like like level like eye level. He was just walking around. He had binoculars and a ponytail. Like or like was he walking around through the binoculars? <laughs> dude, I don't know. Oh okay. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see you at AVNs, but I'm I'm really glad that you got to go. And oh, we we did a live it. podcast oh, there. Yeah. It was awesome. Yeah, that's awesome. It was really cool. Honestly, it's like, so fun. It's it really is. Uh, I was there this year. I think was probably like one of my more tamer years, but all of the other years. Wasn't it like a week ago? Was it recent? It was this year. Oh, well, with the Vegas one. That was definitely this year. That was year. I went. Oh, I, I thought I saw somebody posting about it. I was in. Oh, and I might have been another another uh, expo, but but yeah, that was January. But th that was in January, but and then we didn't go for. Uh, what were you? We didn't go in twenty twenty, or we we went in twenty twenty, and then we got in lockdown. Did you have nominations? I didn't have any nominations this year. I just did. Um, I presented. I was presenting. What award did you um, present? One of them was their best anal. That's stunning. And that one. the other one I didn't was that one. Uh, runner, up, that. runner up. Yeah. A best male actor or male act or best performer. I met Johnny Sins there. I that was believe. great. He's so calm. Yeah, I met him too, and he was like, he's the nicest guy ever. He's just, but he doesn't calm. do anything outside of. Oh, like, you met Johnny Sins? Yeah, yeah. Yes. He's like yeah. so like yeah. normal. Like he's very sweet. He's super. Yeah. He's Who won very best male actor? And by the way, is that like the performance, the role I, player? I honestly I can't scene? remember. Okay. I really can't remember. But like best performer and best. Uh, female and male yeah, performers, yeah. like I, the ones that you want to get. I told Trevor this too. Like, what um, and I asked him what he would say, but like, what do you think's the most difficult, like acting, like you know, like when people say I'd usually skip this part, so it's like the the build up. I don't skip. Like, if I you're watch like it a schoolgirl type or whatever, like UPS driver, 
Have you ever had like a difficult acting role before the scene? Um, not like difficult, but there's some that like weren't fun or yeah. like there what's were... been your favorite you think i really liked whenever i used to work for like pure taboo and like it was really like silly based on like the acting they really didn't and we did like some weird shit like one of them i think it was like very futuristic and there it was it was they always just had really good like story plots that um you could like tap into and they let me write one and it was called nymphomania or something like that and i was like a patient and a psych ward and i got and it was in a straight jacket and they let me like totally like write and like help with it you were in a straight jacket yes and then a guy walked in he's like let me take you out of that jacket no, and and then I like I did it. a blow job in the straight jacket and in a straight jacket. Yes, no hands. No hands. Bob for a right second. There. For a second, and then it was off. No, there was this one scene like that. It was so crazy. I don't. She was. She. Uh, but how? For what? a second, they put a paper bag over my head, and I hated it. Oh, and damn. They took it off. You're like, what the fuck? I'm hot. What are you doing? I know. I don't need this shit. It was a very, oh, it's a it was very, it was like a Scooby Doo porn. It was pull it off. Very it long, you. but then they took it off. But that sight, I remember. It was fun. Really, it was really. Fun Did the bag have holes in it? It's because we were doing weird shit. Yeah, like the that. straight jacket thing, I kind of can get behind. Like, yeah, really? I kind of like that. You do. Well, no, I mean like a crazy chick, like oh, right, right, you don't have right. to go like too far with it. But yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, be hot like, is like a girl on like death row, and she's like, "What do you want your last meal to be?" And she's like, "I want that guy right there." I love that. That's pretty like hot. Mur- like oh, he, that's, that is really yeah. Hot. And yeah. then after you guys make love, they just electrocute her. That I was gonna ask you. What do you think your best role would be? Wow, I've You're, never even thought of that. I, that's a good. That's, I, that's a good idea. That might great actually happen. Idea. Idea. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think my best role. I would be the neighbor next door. I'd be like, "Oh, hey, do you mind if I borrow a cup of sugar?" Oh. Oh, oh! It looks like I got my sugar right in front of me. And it's yeah, hurting. I love that. There you go. I think yeah. that you you do a good job with that. Or like if somebody moved into the house next door and I would bring like a fruit cake, but underneath the fruit cake is um, yeah, you know, yeah, <laughs> yeah, of course. See, but I don't know if you could perform in a moment like that. No, I would train for it. I'd go to acting. Is, is the acting school. like important, like for you? Do people give a fuck, or is that like? whatever i'm no i'm no longer doing anything mainstream porn yeah. at all but when i was doing it it was important to me and i am now doing only like mainstream um acting but yeah it is important to me i yeah. I, I absolutely love it what uh what are you working on now um so my first feature film just came out divinity and it hey, is yeah. currently in theaters That's which huge. is really really awesome it's actually a really surreal experience like right now right now right now right now That's what huge. is it um, divinity it's okay. a sci-fi thriller um horror and uh we shot it in 2021 and it's out finally and we went to sundance for it congrats That's huge. thank you it was really great so that was my first feature film that i did like outside of the industry and i had already like really loved acting and i always loved picking up on projects in the adult space that had that um stretch where i could really like you know where you can really dive into that craft um and then once i i I really just didn't think it was possible a to to do to even find that work and so when i got casted for it i it was kind of I had already kind of done everything that I wanted in the adult space anyway, so it it wasn't I really kind of wanted to focus on other stuff by then and I fully went into it and then I shot a, another horror short film in June that is currently in editing and then I'm shooting another one another horror in uh, January. So Good right now you. I'm in the so right now I'm in the horror genre. Yeah, but it's amazing. really really cool. Is it like di- is it super different? Because it's like is it anticlimactic? Because like do you ever like be like damn like I wish we could have sex after or is it like that doesn't happen anymore? <laughs> um no it's not anticlimactic I because right now and I think I mean I I love I do I do love acting and yeah so in the movies is it by your like government name or is it no i'm not i'm, I'm still yeah, emily I'm, I'm saying as emily Willis. yeah i'm not i'm not oh, wait, i'm not s- shying away from that I'm, i don't want to backtrack but i just don't see you as that neighbor 
Like, I think you need, like, I'm a, too young and too hot, right? Like, yeah. you need, like, a nerdier role. A like, nerd? You, you think I look like a nerd? That, like, well, all right. Takes all right, down, like, right, both both over, you guys? like, plus model. Yeah. Is that crazy? I don't know. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. Just, how about both you guys think what role you think I would have, and then on the count of three, you say it. You go, let me know when you got your answers. What do you think, uh, what role I would play in a porn? Ooh. Okay. Without being too disrespectful. <sighs> no, I just, I'm trying to think of something, but yeah. Nothing? Do you have something or no? I was going to go with stepbrother. Stepbrother? Okay. He's I feel totally like, a stepbrother. I feel like I have the best or skin for uncle. a stepbrother. Stepbrother? Yeah. But like uncle? The... Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't go stepbrother to uncle. Why are we keeping it in the family? Is there step uncle? Is that a thing? I feel like Stein oh, would play yeah, a step uncle. I step uncle? I, <laughs> step uncle I, dude. I banged my step uncle. You actually. Did, I feel like I'm I the spoiled sure son. Did. I know. No, yes. There was a, there was like a handsome, whole funny series ass son. on a naughty like step uncle thing. Damn. Yeah. Why, how come uncles are always just creepy? Is that a thing? In in life. Yeah, that's always something. Do you have a creepy or, or uncle? Or like a drunk uncle. I don't There's a drunk uncle uncles, or creepy but I always, uncle. But I do have like drunk uncles. There's always that drunk uncle that's like single that like yeah. gets hammered at like the family events and like yeah yeah dude it's, it's always Tuesday. going well. There's yeah. always that drunk family member. In general. I know what. There's always got to be that, but you need Somebody, that guy. You need that person. And yeah. It becomes like when you get older, it's more of like an entertainment value. It's like you're waiting for him. Yeah, my parents like, like, oh, we're asshole. not inviting him to Thanksgiving. I'm like, no, bring him in. <laughs> bring him in. <laughs> yeah, that's no. our halftime show right there. Yeah, no, exactly. I want to see him turkey slam something. What do you think you would play in a porn? I don't know. So, to be honest. Um. I've I've actually been asked this before, and like oh really oh, yeah really? Angela White asked me oh, oh nice. nice and I've been called like Z Rat before called what Z Rap Z Rat Z Rat yeah I get it so like I don't know why, why? But they like to refer to me as Z Rat it's like a bot like when I first started working they called me like the rat like I, I was like an informant okay. like, I don't know if that's oh, a compliment oh, it's not at all <laughs> saying. Yeah, I don't but know. in my head I played off it and like I was like a rat and like Angela White was like pest control. And then it turned into like a porn. I don't know if that's bad. So you think you'd play a rat in porn? Like a Peter Pettigrew, like from Harry Potter, that turns into a human. Is that too much? That's awful. Okay. Uh, <laughs> that's what about like a awful. CSI Miami, like detective? That's a crazy that's, switch. That's way better. That's way better, well, right? CSI Miami. Way better. That is a rat. CSI Miami sounds fun. I mean, you snitching. Yeah. You're a rat to rat. I'm more into that. Well, yeah, that's true. That was yeah, Angela. You're playing by a rat. Really wasn't did. Me that, that. that was Angela was into that. She's like into like. Angela brought up the CSI Miami thing. No, she Angela told like, me to do thing, anything. I want you as like a pet. Like I want to like. Oh, Angela loves like dominating. Like she. Like she want to dominate me. Like she's pest control. Trying to get I would to... totally love it. Like, why wouldn't you? Yeah, I don't know about that. Like a red ball type thing, like a ball gag. No, That's up you. That's your like that. I, I can't. That. That. Just... I've never done that. Have you done that? No. Would you be open uh -huh. to that? Oh, and you on got... me? Yeah. That's no. See, that's... I could do it. I mean, yeah, I'd do anything. I'm gonna be for the honest. Bit. I think. I think that's a more fitting role. Like, I'm just scared, steps but... on gets dominated <laughs> right up your alley, bro. I'm just curious. Like, what happens if you have that in your mouth and you? But what if you sneeze and that's in the, you know, you just choke it's on it? It's uncomfortable. You've done yeah. it? How, yeah, I, I've gotten gags like that. And I oh. honestly, I, I didn't like it. I'm extremely claustrophobic. So I never was really into, I'm not into like anything that suffocates me in any type of way. No. Like the ropes and stuff. I think I, I didn't do any. You're saying like, parkour? Get the shit out of here. Stuff. Like, I don't want to be restricted like that. No. They won't, all these guys want us to do one of those, um, Silent rooms, like they're the quietest rooms. Like, have oh, you heard of those? I haven't heard of a silent room. It's like a the quietest room it's in like, the country. It's like what, like an escape oh, room, I've seen but those. like it's if a you, silent room? Yeah, if you drop that. something, like so you'd be it's a room like this, twenty four hours, and it's the most silent it could be. I don't think that I don't think you can like be in there longer than like an hour without going crazy or something because it's like oh, so yeah. quiet. All you can hear is like you can hear like, your heart racing and you can, all your thoughts are like the loudest they've ever been. Yeah, it's <gasps> yeah. No, I think I would leave immediately. Imagine going in that bitch hungover. No, actually, yeah, maybe not no. a bad place to sleep, though. Oh, dude, that's no. you sleep quiet. Yeah, you why you're a TV guy? No, a fan. I no, sleep with a fan. I, on. I, yeah, I see. I don't sleep quiet. I do you wear an eye mask? No, I don't. I did my first eye mask last night. An Have you eye ever mask? done that? <laughs> oh, really? like a night mask. Yeah. Oh, a night mask. Is it dark in your room? They're nice sometimes if I can't see. This fucking little light that I can't like unsee. Yeah, it just fucks me up. So I tried a night mask. I had to take like two shots of Nyquil, but it worked. But yeah, I tried that. <laughs> That's the liver night mask right there. Yeah. Do you sleep with no noise? No, uh, Silent? Pretty much, yeah. It's completely dark and no noise. That's Dude, crazy. That's really nice. That's, that's crazy. How comfy is I that? Need, I need... I like the... I, I like... I'm a rain person. I, mm. actually, I like to listen... I'll go... I have like my whole thing on YouTube that I listen to on rain sounds. Um, I love going to sleep to the rain. 
That's like my favorite That's thing. very like peaceful for me or like anything. Literally anything like a podcast, like meditation, anything. Not necessarily like even the tea. I don't care. But I I guess it's it's harder though to fall asleep like to music. I can't fall asleep that to music because then I'm distracted. But I do like sounds yeah. in the background. Yeah. What do you guys do if you can't sleep? Do you have those nights? Like restless nights? I jerk off. Yeah. Yeah, I I guess I do too. Yeah. <laughs> that's helps. Like, it really does help. That's like that organic well, melatonin that, it actually right there. It really does yeah. help. Yeah, no, I I go through that too. But when that doesn't work, then I'm like, what the fuck now? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just looking out the window looking for then answers. You can just go on TikTok or do yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. Then, the, then you're screwed at that point. Yeah, yeah. for you to burn your eyes. Trying to avoid that at all, at all costs. Yeah, I don't know. It's it's tough because a lot of times I do shows late at night and then I'll drink a bunch of coffee and then I'm just laying in bed after and just like nothing will put me to sleep. Yeah. Mm. Oh, Emily, are you sing? You're single right now. I am single. What's yes. what do you like look for if you're gonna go into a relationship? I just got out of a relationship. Yeah, like, I feel like you were in one for a minute, no? Yeah, I was in it. I was in it for two and a half years. And damn. Yeah, and we broke up like two. Or, or it was in August. Um. So, and I know I'm really enjoying being single because I wasn't single. Well, also, it sounds like you're really busy, so it's like not I'm like... really busy, so it's work. It's just been nice. Um, uh, I'm not really necessarily trying to be with, like, yeah. beat up by any means right now. Um, just because I, I like being single right now. Me too. And, and for the, and I, and before that relationship, I really was single before, like, just because I was focused on work. And, that's the same and, problem and, i was and, having too it's like focusing on work and balancing it's like a second job having a relationship yeah you know yeah what you gotta put in the effort yeah it's it's but i mean like, I'm like, like, I, have, like i do my thing but like i'm not so you need like a plus one to the premiere is what you're saying it's crazy. <laughs> but you're single <laughs> too no trevor yeah 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 just what three you... pingos just three single people trying to figure it out you know yeah no i know like, what are you saying but, no oh, you're just, single? Like, mm-hmm. nice. when was the last time you got laid been a minute i feel like what the fuck? <laughs> no, I don't know. I just got that vibe. Last weekend? No, actually? Yeah. Damn. What do you mean actually? I don't know. I was just curious, bro. I, <laughs> you think I, I'm so fucking loser? No, I wasn't throwing shade. I was just curious. Like, it's been a minute for me, too. So, yeah. How long for you? Uh, I've been on, like, a four-week dry streak. Really? Whoa, dude. Wow. See, you should just start telling people you're going celibate. It sounds cooler. I know. That's like, the dude, new move. like, dude, I've been celibate move. for a month. That's the new excuse for I can't get laid. Like, cranky about it i'm like oh it's because i haven't had sex it's like that's why i'm crazy yeah no i'm going through those cravings but like i've just also realized like i'm looking for something different too you know what i mean that long term that long i guess it's play. like fall time it's like you know what i mean you like want to hang out it's like yeah. you get to win like, i want like, like, like a girlfriend yeah. watch halloween movies like, I get ready for the holidays the theaters. i want to watch a movie exactly yeah sometimes it is nice i guess like for me like i i have my like you know, everybody has their, like, people that they, like, randomly hook up with. But it's nice when – it also is nice having, like, people that you do hook up with where you're, like, hooking up and, like, you're hanging out as well. Oh, the casual things? Yeah. I need more of those. Where it's just – Situation yeah, Oh, no, I totally – I, I have – you, you probably can get them easier than, like, me. It actually works out really nice when you're both, like – when you really are just friends and you just hook up and like there's no expectations of it and you know like what you're both there for and you can have I'm a good night and enjoy looking. each other's company and yeah. then it's and then we'll see you fucking in a couple days or next week or whatever right and i it's actually really nice when both people are on the same how do you page. get involved in one of those like with you um <laughs> <laughs> He's asking Are for you a friend. Are asking for a friend? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never asked me to ask. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, Stanley's like writing notes about this. Like, yeah, yeah, so like, no, I'm just curious. Like, how does that even go down? Or, like, are there like qualifications beforehand? Qualifications? Yeah. Yeah. What's your ideal height in a man? Oh, I, not trying to single anybody. I don't out go in this off. Room. Of it. I don't. I guess I'm. I'm not like a. I'm not like. You're open to anything. I mean, huh? like five ten and up. That's crazy. I'm six foot. No, you're good. How yeah. tall are you? Yeah, no. I, on dating like, apps, five ten. Aren't you like six foot seven or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. six foot. Yeah. So uh, you are not. Uh, no, I know. I don't. I don't meet those qualifications. But like, you make exceptions, <laughs> but, don't you? But you know, physically maybe not, Wait, but what? mentally he's six like, foot. Yeah, exactly. He he got oh, that. He got that alpha go. mentality. Yeah, alpha go. mentality. That's what I'm gonna put in my what dating about profile. Qualifications. Oh, man. Mentally. Yeah, I'm mentally six, six three. Foot. Wait, is that actually like that's a requirement? No, I don't know. No, I'm just. But you're just trying to shit on me. <laughs> I feel bad about myself. I was, yeah, I guess I was. Okay. 
Um, oh. <laughs> I don't have like a certain require. I actually really don't have a type. I my dating history is kind of a little bit all over the place, but um, I guess I'm like here for the vibes. Yeah, fuck yeah. I love I'm that. all about connection, but also like, you know what? Yeah, of course. Like, I want to be attracted to somebody. Fuck yeah, gotta be fit, funny. Funny is funny. Funny's is a, huge. Funny is a big one for me. Funny's and big. Yeah. Funny is a big one for me just because, like, make you laugh. Not, yeah, on your status of days. Laugh. Yeah. Yeah, it's crazy. Where do you find a funny man in this town? Yeah. There's a lot of us out here, too. So it's like, it's competitive probably, too, right? <laughs> I guess so. Yeah. Oh, um, Stan, you're making me laugh, dude. What's up? No, what's up? Uh, <laughs> now, that, now that you're going to the acting, uh, <laughs> what's like a dream acting role? Oh, man. I, I really. She's like Princess Leia. In I Star really want to be a Bond girl. James Bond? Yeah. Oh, I think she had a blonde girl. No, I was like, oh, I feel like that's pretty easy. A Bond girl. I want to be James yeah. Bond. Girl. That would be, be really sick. fun. You think I could ever get cast as James Bond? I think Do you I should already like be. Like Bruce Wayne, probably. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like Batman. You I think you do a hybrid of the two. Yeah. Yeah. You think I could. Double O Bruce. Yeah. I don't know. That's like a dream for me. Just to be like, because James Bond is. Well, that's what you could role so play fun. as. Yeah. Is James Bond? Ooh. What about this? Batman? People said you're a rat. Rat man. No, no. Come on. No, I don't think that's going to turn into like a hot like scene. Could. New York, you, it takes place in New York. It's you, Angela White. You're somewhere in Brooklyn. You would do it Rat for man. Angela White. Come on. Oh, fuck. Yeah, probably. Would you do Hell it for yeah. me? Yeah. <laughs> Done. We could film. We could set that up ASAP if you want to. But um, actually, though, do you have like a dream role? No, I, I just said it. Um, I, I don't know. I really, I, I love playing like complex characters. Yeah. Yeah, those are the fun ones. Yeah. What about you, Trev? You've been Dream here? role. Uh, you do like all these skits and shit, so it's like, yeah. what, when do you, when do you feel like I get get to the like cinema? I'm trying, man. I'm, I'm waiting, you know? people. Are, but I'm also not waiting. I got my, my special coming out on uh, uh, Prime Video, Amazon Prime, November 14th. First stand-up special is dropping on there. Stand-up special on Amazon Prime? Yeah. I'm trying to sun me on my own pod right now. I have shit coming out, too. We'll talk about my Christmas. Oh, no, I, I just, you know. Yeah, yeah, no, go ahead. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I just want to get my chill bro fucking no, plug your milk shit. dogs yeah. watching this to go tap into that. Yeah, yeah, no, go ahead. But I I don't know. I just hope that, like, I just want to be in, like, the next, like, Dave or, like, you know, what what's oh, the next workaholics? Cool. Like, shit like that. really cool. Oh, my gosh. I what just, is like, the next workaholic? You know, like, I would love they to do something do like that. shit like that no more. Not so much. It sucks. Uh, there's no, yeah. there's nothing like that anymore. Uh-uh. And I would just love to either be a part of something like that or I'd love to show up to somebody's movie. That they already written, direct, like directed, and then just pop up, do my thing for two yeah, days, yeah. get in and get out. Yeah, can be. How like, sick is it to like have your own like chair with your name on it, and then your own writer, and like you literally just go and read lines. Yeah, I would love to do that. That'd be I mean, awesome. How do you get to that point? I don't know. I've auditioned for all types of shit. I auditioned for uh, Stranger Things, didn't get that. I auditioned oh. for a bunch of shit, a bunch of. It was a stoner character in Stranger Things, so I smoked weed before the audition. Got too high. What do you, yeah. What do you think? Why don't you think you got it? You I was too high. Candidates out there? Because I wasn't like chill high. I was like paranoid high. I was like looking, like freaking out. Yeah. Read. Because like usually if I smoke with like you guys would be chill, where you're like going back and forth. But like yeah, yeah. this was like middle of the day, bright ass room. This girl with like a video camera. I was just like, okay, go, it go. And I was like, uh, uh, uh. And I like <laughs> fucked up my line. And then I was like, wait, can I do it again? And she's like, yeah. I didn't tell her I was high. She probably just thought I was just like, was not what the brightest. What made you decide to get high before that? I don't know. Someone was talking to me. I was yeah. like, dude, because the, the role was a stoner role. Yeah. And then I got like an acting teacher for that role and everything. And then I was like, should I smoke for this? She's like, if it helps you get in character. I was like, sure. It, it didn't. It did not. No. no. Do you regret that decision? No, I thought it was funny. Could you give us a read right now? Of that role? Yeah. I don't remember it. No. This was like two years ago. Fuck. Our auditions are tough. They're you, so hard. Yeah, yeah. I feel like I'd you freak just the go fuck through out so many sometimes, like before. You... you just read off a piece of paper, like yo, like I'm auditioning. No, you're all out, like just memory. Yeah. Oh, and you, if, you, if you look yeah, at the paper, yeah. they they see it as like, oh, they're not prepared. That's, that's yeah. a deduction. Yeah, yeah literally. You don't want to be on off, on script. Damn. Yeah, and it's just like some random person with like some shitty VCR camera just being like, all right, say this, like, all right, start crying and say this scene. You're like, all right, like, but that's like what real actors do. Yeah. Like, I say I act, but there's, like, for real actors out there. Like, there's a difference between what I do and, like, good, good acting. Yeah. Like, they are talented. I know. I think I could get to that point. Could though. you cry on camera, you think? Fuck yeah, I could. You could? Yeah. Can we see it right now? I mean. It's still show us. Right now? Okay, fine. Give me a, give me a scenario and I'll act it out right now. Oh, okay. So give you're a something. rat. No, no. <laughs> anything better. Like, seriously. I'll, I'll give um, you a like, scenario. Right. Like, come home and, like, 
Okay, I come home and my 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 mom's cheating on my dad or some shit. You'd cry for that? Yeah. I was just gonna if say. I was a kid. No, is that not enough? Okay, I come home, my oh, yeah, mom just killed on. my dad. Is that better for you? Uh, okay, we're getting better. And then and then and then she looks at you and she goes, "It's all your fault." Okay. So and then where, she puts I'm a revolver gonna, down. So you you want to play the mom? This. I'm mom. Okay. Yeah. Do I got like a rack on me or no? That's not important in my. <laughs> I feel like it is, <laughs> I don't dude. think so. Uh, I wouldn't cry for so an So you just killed my dad, and now I have to react, right? Yes. All right. What's Emily in this? Yeah, I didn't are, know that. We you were the, involved are you, are in you the dad? Just... <laughs> yeah, yeah I mean, am I the dad? I mean, you, you, you can improv your role. What do you want to play right now? So he's... Is he the guy that killed you? Maybe, maybe, maybe actually we switch it up and... I'm dead. I'm you're the dad. You're dead and she's the mom. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, Because you've been doing a lot of horror films. <laughs> so this this is up your alley. Okay, so what what are we what is the okay, what is the what is the You just what, you what just, just killed my father. I'm the the father. I killed him. You yeah, shot me. And you're my you're my mom. Okay. And but you're gonna blame it on me. You say this is all your fault. You say it's this tiny and he's gonna cry on camera. I'm dead. Oh, it already started. <laughs> this is all your fault, Tiny. You don't know this would have happened. No, why are you always doing this to me? What happened, mom? Mommy, I, I'm mom. sorry. You weirdly. What happened to dad? He really just wasn't doing it for me anymore. I couldn't take it anymore. I couldn't fucking stand looking at him. I really couldn't. But now you're gonna sit here and you're gonna take this blame for me. Okay. And no it, one's gonna have to know about it or. We don't have to talk about it, and you don't have to see me anymore. And well, I mean, you kind of you, you look kind of you look kind of sexy. <laughs> <laughs> like the blood, I don't know. It's just kind of turning me on. And then does that? Get I it? don't talk to my wife like that. <laughs> is that good or no? That, that was, was good. I feel like you you were honestly way better than me. Of course I was. Yeah. Like a bet, you didn't do shit there, Trevor. I, I was dead. Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. Was, yeah that but that's a compliment. Yeah. If you didn't do anything for a dead guy, it's pretty dead. Yeah, no, that's true. That's true. That's true. It's that's kind of a compliment if you think about it. All right, let's go back to uh, to the old days real quick, if we could. Is that cool? Yeah. I just I'm always curious. Like he he talked about like the the peeing thing recently on his podcast. Peeing. Uh, go ahead and do your thing. The plug your podcast real quick if you want stiff socks yeah, stiff yeah. socks podcast emily yeah. was on a couple yeah, years yeah. ago has been on it there's yeah. actually yeah. a really funny fucking video um but there was a, like a peeing fetish peeing? Where, like dudes pee in girls mouths is there is a, a peeing fetish is that a real thing it is um i i i no longer partook in it but but you've experienced you have that? what's that like I, I got shut down by my agent he was like you can't do this anymore um, Damn, but, I would, you think that would be the golden ticket? Um, it only happened a couple of times, and it's fun if they're hydrated. Yeah, of course. True. It's really fun if is they're there like hydrated. A taste there, or is like a bitter taste? It can be bitter. Yeah, yeah if they have their vitamins, gnarly. this shit's bright. But yeah. that's just like with like any kind of fluid from any human. It can be good or it can be bad. Right. My um, shit's always clear as fuck, by the way. Hydrated? Yeah. Nice. I, nice. Our water's really important. Nice. I feel like you don't... Do you keep up on your water intake or not? I try. Okay. I'm, I try, I'll try. Yeah, yeah. Take a little sip. Uh, is, what's the weirdest fetish you've ever seen? Um, Trevor, you could answer this. I did like, have this one guy that was this, like... It's always interesting to me. It was always interesting when, like, guys were, like, really, like, insensitive to their balls. Um, what do you mean by that? Like, they could take a hammer to it? They, yeah, they just well, paved it really like weird, and, um, one, oh, one guy put his in my, and. Jesus. <laughs> You're I, like, sir, oh, that's like, the wrong body it, part. How does that even, He was like, into it, about? and I was so afraid, because I was like, what do you mean? Like, doesn't this hurt? And he was like, no, no, I like it. Um, that's insane and, fetish. Um, well, imagine being the penis. You're like, wait, isn't that my job? Yeah, like, no, yo, what are you I, doing, dog? I and that was like, it was Don't weird. cut the line. It just felt funny. Like, it was not, but it was cool. I mean, I went with it. Yeah. It no. was fun just because it was, I'm like, what is you, going did you on enjoy here? That? I mean, I was just going with the flow. Right. I'm like, and I'm I don't cool, know what's like, going on, but yeah. this is cool. I love to try new things. That <laughs> probably wouldn't be the first thing I'd try, but we could get creative if we ever, like, get to that point. What is your kink? Oh, shit. 
I mean, like, just when, women. it depends. Cause I like, feel like he, like, skin, like... I feel it like depends on who I'm with, because I usually can read, like, the vibe. Like, we, like, it can get steamy crazy in there, like, foreplay, like, for hours. Or... It could be like some tie me to the bed, like. Let's say it's your birthday. Yeah, this girl it. wants to satisfy you. I knew it. I knew you. Tie you to the bed. Tied up. I've I had that happen it. once. What did she use? Like a USB cord? Nah, a bandana. And then she also covered my eyes. Really? Yeah. I was literally there. Like I was a like, pinata. I was like, he's the kind of type of guy that not he a looks pinata. Tied up. Like, yo, this is a handsome ass dude with like a very defined like. Huge. I, I tied you up. <laughs> well, I got tied up. But, and, but and it was like, but it was like, it was like, like her type fantasy and i was like fine you can have this one so what's your type fantasy let's say this girl like comes over for your birthday she's like standing i want to like make you like in like a washing machine like stuck you are no like the chick's like stuck in a washing machine oh that's your fantasy yeah what of course why is that weird i feel like we've all heard of this well no that's what you did no yeah that's what i did was that is that is that is this a stuck hole thing like over like what's good with that? No, I feel like people still do it. I love that. I Are they like, finding shit that like still get stuck in? Thing. You gotta get stuck in an air fryer in twenty twenty three. Like a crazy <laughs> stuck, like get stuck in like a clamp or like yeah. I feel like they're running out of shit stuck to get in stuck like in. a car like yeah. engine. Yeah, exactly. Like I'm stuck in the fire hydrant. Like, the thing how about the stuck one is like the. The opportunities are fucking endless. It's yeah, and that's that's really funny though. Like yeah, why? But. I don't know. I don't I know, but it makes that. sense. Yeah, I feel like it's Trevor over here. I feel like your shit's just like Manila, like. Missionary. I get stuck in the washing machine. No, I feel like your shit's just missionary. Like that's. No, I don't like missionary. I'll come too quick. Yeah. No, it's too, too much bodily fluids pushing down. <laughs> yeah. It's a gravity thing. Yeah. No, I, I'm just you know I'm just big, big D O double G guy doggy. Yeah. yeah. You know? Oh yeah, love that. Come up there just thinking about my life. Right. <laughs> yeah, no, me too. I don't know. I, I mean, the, you can tell by my build. It's not like I fucking kick down a door and lay it down. Yeah. But I don't not not lay it down. <laughs> no, I. It's like but a, you're above average, but not. It's like a double crazy. double in and out. You're satisfied, but you're For not sure. like oh, you know, not the, the next, best I ever had. But I'm happy. Yeah, the next morning it. you're like, I, well, all right. Yeah, I'll hit yeah, him up again. Good. One more yeah. chance. Yeah, where we That's go? All you need twice is all you need. Yeah, it's it's not the night they'll never remember, but it's not the night they'll never forget. <laughs> exactly. You know, it's like I'm on that same page. You know. But that's also I'm cool with they, that. They, they'll they'll think about it in like a month. I'm like, oh yeah, yeah, that was a thing, right? Yeah, I love that. What do you think has been your favorite skit you've ever done? More with Emily. That was great. I mean, that was really funny, and we shot at a park. That like, was randomly. really funny. That was really one. And I like that one. Yeah. Who was with us? Uh, Amanda. Amanda was in. Yeah, she's so funny. She's very funny. Yeah. She's Amanda so funny. Sweet. Amanda I love McCants. watching her stuff. Okay. Yeah. Good. Wait, she was in that skit. For she had a really quick cameo. Yeah. She I like literally completely missed that part. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, well, you were, you were skipping that around that video looking for the porn, weren't no, you? I saw that. You're like YouTube, what the? No, fuck? I saw that. Part. It was really funny though. He when that was like, I mean, I had watched his work before. I, I hit him up in the DMs. I was like, hey, we should oh, collab. Wow. I hit him up. I did. Um, Shit. And it must have been popping. <laughs> you were popping. And I, I thought so it was I... really funny. And because I watched this, what was my first video? It was the making banana pancakes. I don't know. We were doing something. And uh, um, so I already thought he was funny, but then I met him and it was like, oh, he's really funny. Oh, hell yeah. Thank you. Yeah. No, that was that was hilarious. I just thought it was a fun one. And it just felt okay. like uh, yeah. how many people help with your creative? Is it me. You? It's mainly me. I'd say it's like 90 percent me. Then I have two other guys I work with who are like kind of pitch ideas off of. I'll be like, what do you think about this? I'm like, eh, or. But I like to film with my friends who are also like just funny people, too, because yeah. I like bring what I bring. They mm -hmm. bring what they bring. And then it kind of makes like just double the funny. Yeah. And you do, Trevor. You're fucking hilarious, by the way. Thank you, man. Like, that was. I think most... I'm actually kind of funnier than you, but like, I went you're... to one of his stand-up shows, and he was really good too. Oh, thank you so yeah, much. Fuck, thank that? you. I think it was last stand-up special, November fourteenth, like, Prime Video, or something. But like, you were there for like the main event. And he was kind of opening, or how did that? Yeah, I went with my girlfriend. To... One of my girlfriends. Like and... it was a coincidence that he was performing, or or did you go to the Trevor Wall show? Yeah. Oh just, no just no no! I never. <laughs> yeah no no. He was like opening type thing. Yeah. I think I went that night. You went before me, I think. I opened for him. Yeah. Aww. Would you ever do stand up? I'd try it. You would do it. Yeah. You should, dude. I know. I should. I feel like I'd be so intimidating. I gotta give it to you guys. Fuck. I mean, it's it's definitely nerve wracking. It's like improv. Like, like it's. You just gotta be confident. You go up there and like, I don't know. You just run with it. And if yeah. It works out. It works out. I feel like I I would I would do it if I had like. I kind of want to give you a good. Now. A scene, and we run it back, like on a different scene. Like I felt like my acting was a one. <laughs> You're acting now. When you just said like, did you actually like really? People funny? came in here when you were in the bathroom. They came in here and they're like, dude, 
those real tears like that was fucking crazy i swear yeah they said they're gonna it, clip it, that it, and just send that to the casting yeah wow yeah like warner bros some, is getting I that fucking issue over Brazzers, here. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, yeah. yeah there we go <laughs> yeah uh do you want should we run is the casting couch no? real that's what i want to know have you done that one i never did casting couch no i don't think i did what about bang bus I never did Bang Bus. Either. I shot a podcast on the Bang Bus. Once. Did you actually? Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. I, I made a sketch in there too years ago. Oh my ago. gosh, that's it was actually awesome. really funny. Everybody's signatures are at the top. Yeah, that's actually really. Iconic, but is it like though. clean in there, bro? Spotless. Oh, dude, I'm so sure. nice. I dropped a piece of chicken on the floor and ate it off the floor. I got pregnant. No, it is. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Like, it was a don't ask, don't tell type of thing. But like the seatbelt, like the the belt crinkled a little bit. So I think there might have been some residue. What episode was that? <laughs> Wait, was there like a follow-up? Uh, it was, was me, Adam22. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> no, that, okay, perfect. We were oh. going to talk about this. Oh, you saw that? Yes. Me and Trevor were talking before you got here about how Adam and Lena are not doing a new show. Oh, they are? Like the... And they're looking for... Oh, I had just... I had briefly just seen it, I think, while I was on my way here. So, they do Plug Talk where Adam... And Lena do a podcast yeah. with another girl. Did you ever do that, bro? He gets a three-way. I've done... Yeah, I, oh, yeah, I've hooked up with... Uh, you, you did Plug Adam Talk? Yeah, I did plug talk. Yeah, and then now you interview, then hook up. <clears throat> yes. Yeah. Yeah. So it's like, but it's always right, two it's like girls, what we're guy. doing right now, and then and but then two girls. Go. And I'm by, by the way, I'm never doing two guys. Hold so on. I don't know what's going through. Well, she was like, "It's what we're doing I'm right now." Doing I was guys. like, "Hold on." I'm not doing two guys. I'm not doing two guys unless she's down right after this. Then I'll do it one time. Okay. I was time the exception. Okay, this is one exception. I'm down for that. Okay. But um, Adam is doing and Lena, they're doing a casting call for the first guy to do it with them. So two guys. Oh, oh. With, with them, it's not just to oh, hook up with yeah, her. Because they've never no. done that. Good yeah. for them. Yeah. It's I fun. mean, it's a genius idea. It's like it's. But who got casted? That's where me and you could shine. I think my buddy got casted in there. Who's also <laughs> I could act yeah, that. Guys in there. Get in there. I, I could act get in that, there. But we didn't get called. <laughs> like for an audition. Didn't? Yeah, I mean, there, there's a lot of money to be made in this. I've said this before. I think Adam's. I feel like class. everybody, everybody, and their mother is coming out with a podcast right now. Well, this is a different type. of Plug Talk's not just everyday pod. Yeah. Neither is this oh, one. Well, this yeah, is the best one right now, but yeah. <laughs> Plug Talk, I feel like it's like this new era. It's like, I told Adam, he should have had me on there. Like, on what? Like, he should have, I should have been Jason Oh, you've never been on? <laughs> why? why? They would have made, they would have made so much more money. Why Jason the biggest dude ever? Like, why not just. Well, you're the second biggest guy <laughs> ever, right? Yeah. But That's like, true. But like, also like, it's a different thing. Like, it's more like, oh, like, she's definitely going to come back. Like, with Jason, it's different, right? Like you're giving her the biggest thing out there. Like just give her the second biggest thing. She might fall in love with you, dude. That's true. Then they gotta break She's up. Probably, but with Jason, it's more business. And then like, you're Adam twenty three now. <laughs> yeah. No, exactly. Would you go on that show and would you win? Would I I Man, you stepped daddy. With the acting, I could win. But I don't know what else they're looking for. Like a thruple. Yeah, I know, but like if it's Are like all emotional connection, I'll win the emotional connection all day. I'll what's your money on what's that. your go to opening DM? Yo. Where you at? I'm pretty. I'm pretty lazy. Are you guys that actually? Yeah. But like, you see a hot chick on IG, bullshit, like break icebreaker type shit. Like, I can't do that. You say, "Yo, where are you at?" Just like, "Yo, you in There's New York?" No or, Yo, way. you in LA? I swear to God. That's terrible. Well, I, if I'm not in the same city, like it's like. Whatever. Oh well, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, Why, I what's see. your go-to? What do you mean? So you mean like you're just hitting up girls in different cities so you can say? Well, if Yo, I'm in New York and I see like this chick lives in New York, I'm like, "Hey, are you in the city?" And you said go straight into yo, where you at? Yeah, well, I mean, what would you recommend? Probably oh, a that. shirtless Steiny photo would, would help. <laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> like an better. NFT, just no comment, just shirtless. What well, is that? What you usually do, or what's your go-to? Probably that. Yeah. Yeah, where you at? How many really? times does that work? No, I've never done the the where you at. <laughs> I go shirtless selfie. Yeah, is that what are you? Oh, one for what? Uh, probably oh for forty three. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So yeah, I sent one I to you, but you left me on red. Um, well, yeah. I don't even. I, I don't even. I try to like say something like about their profile. I'll just like comment on something that they like say. In I know. The, I gotta get yeah. more creative That's with them. I'm just fucking do. lazy. What in, what DM would impress you? Yeah. From a guy, Emily. I like. I do like. I like like the efforted ones. For sure. Would you rather well, it be like funny I only, or I just funny. nice? But I only I do that when it makes sense. But it's like, but like when it makes sense, like I comment or like whatever I posted that day on my story or something. That's yeah. that's I feel like everybody does that now. I feel like or like you start liking each other's stories all the time. It's like hey, like, mm -hmm. yeah, that's a modern day um, like Facebook. That's post. or like actually no. I recently started talking to somebody and they actually did ask me where you at, 
and you responded. And I did <laughs> it was respond. you. I did you respond. did. You responded. No, it wasn't me, I swear. To the yo, where are you at? So it works. And I actually did that one time. Bro, I'm telling you. Damn. More effortless. Was it Steiny who DM you? <laughs> but yo, let's. I'm not sliding on like. It's like different. Like I'm sliding on chicks that have like, they're not like all over the internet like type shit. Like they're not famous, whatever. It's like girls that have like 2K followers type thing. So when I'm effortless, I try and like have that do the work. If that's is that fucked up? I I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't know. Sure. I don't know where I'm trying to go with this, but I'm like I'm more transparent of like, yo, what's up? What are you doing tonight? Like, are we gonna like go get drinks? Are we gonna hang out? You hit him with the 21 questions. Yeah. You're like, doo, 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 doo. yeah. No, but like if it make like if Emily like if I were to ever DM you, uh-huh. it'd be like the most fucking creative like. And when you wouldn't go for the Oriat? No, oh. absolutely not. Oh. Yeah, it would be like a. <laughs> what would you What would you DM? Hey, I just saw I just saw the movie that just came out and I loved it. You were absolutely amazing. That's actually Aww, good. That's and sweet. I would love to talk. And to what's that movie it. called? Yeah, which is, one? Is it Diversity? A Divinity. 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 Yeah. Yeah. No, I just I saw you in that and you did a wonderful job and I'd love to talk to you more about your role. And that's actually good. <laughs> yeah. And would you Aww. do voice memo or text? Text. Yeah. Aww. Yeah, that's pretty good, right? Yeah. Would that Would that warrant a response? Well, yeah. No? Oh, yeah, totally. Yeah. yeah. What, what would yours be? Yeah, what would yours Let's be? Let's hear some Trevor? bullshit. I'd be like, yo, I saw that movie you're in. Uh, that shit sucks, girl. <laughs> but you know what else what? sucks? What you doing tonight? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I I think that's great. Complimenting something you're working on. That's somebody you obviously know that they're like, they're a part of and they love it and they're very proud of their piece of work. Like, that's genius. It, it just shows you did your research. I don't think I'd ever do like a copy and paste type thing, like no, like a joke. I don't think I'd do that. No, never. But you got to go into it, and you got to have like effort. And honestly, too, I cannot wait until that comes out. Oh, when does that come out? It's out now. It's out now. Yeah, you should. I want to see it tonight. So you could send that DM tomorrow. But I'm gonna watch it ASAP. Um, And I think uh, anyone out there too should watch it. Yeah, you guys definitely should. Because and how how long do you how many lines do you have? I well, I'm one of the main characters in, in the film. Get yeah. out of here! Are you serious? Yeah. What the fuck? How have I not seen this yet? I have you been well, promoting it, it. Yeah, hell yeah, I have. I think so. I was gonna say that I have. That's fucking crazy. Yeah. This is um, the hottest thing out there right now. I think. I it was I it's a really really cool experience. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Well, I'm gonna tune in tonight. Yeah, you, you got should. two stars on this couch right here. There you go. Movie yeah, special. No, you, dude, you got some Amazon Prime special. We're yeah. not sure if it's gonna air. Hey. Is it guaranteed to air or no? Guaranteed to air. It's gonna oh, air. Rad. Yeah, it's already, the trailer's already on Amazon. Oh, it's already it is? On, like, it's the, already like on the oh, streaming nice. platform and everything. Yeah. No. Comes out on uh, Tuesday, 14th. Who are you opening for? Stiney. <laughs> yeah, at the very end, I'm like, all right, that's my time. Now you're main actor the night. Yeah, I do an hour of jokes and then bring you up for. I think how long did you do up there? Like eight hours? Was it eight yeah, hours? Yeah, I was up there for a while. Yeah, and when did you took your shirt off at one point? Took my shirt off. I'm, I've been getting in shape too. The crowd went crazy. But it's like, yeah, no, I mean, that's I do that for the girls because like they get to get fired up. Like this Matt Rife guy, have you seen him? Of course, yeah. It's like being like the good looking comedian, which we both oh, are. Yeah. It's just like I had fallen into that part. I didn't want to be that. But that have them focus on the comedy, but when you're good looking, it just happens like that. What would you say you are a one to ten in L.A.? Like I'm a LA. in L.A. Yeah, like with everything included. Everything. Okay, are they sober, drunk? Like what's? <laughs> uh, <laughs> average of everything. Seven to eight. Seven to eight. Like yeah, like okay, it's cool. between there. Yeah. Why would you? What would you think? No, I just feel like you strike me as somebody who'd be like ten out of ten. Next question. No, I'll keep it real. <laughs> yeah, no, I'll keep it real. I'm also like, like being humble is very important, right, Emily? Yeah, yeah. Like you don't want to ever like. How much that watch I'm cost? Not a big, like, I'm not a big like flexor. <laughs> How uh, much that watch cost? A lot, a lot. How much is your special? A lot. But what is it like? What's the average view of your special? How, you have to, let's just say this: you have to sell a lot of your specials to get something like this. <laughs> oh fuck! Yeah, 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 probably, dude. That yeah, thing was no, not, that so AP. Important, like I think, like I think, being humble and just like being yourself is like so important. It mm-hmm. is. Like, there's all these LA assholes who would probably be like Trevor and say like, "Yo, I'm a ten out of 10 but I don't think that gets you anywhere. Like, yeah, just I be like yourself confidence. and like be who you are, right? Uh, confidence is sexy, though. Right. Oh, but there's a difference between confidence there's, and delusional. Yes. Oh, yeah. 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 I yeah. Say. That's where you tote the line. Yeah. But that's also why I didn't say 10 out of 10, because I am confident, but I'm also like 8 out of 10. Go ahead, Trevor. What are you? Oh, in, in my head, I'm a 10 out of 10, but I look in the mirror and I go, oh, that's a strong 7. Yeah. <laughs> strong, like strong uppercase seven. 7. Yeah. 
I'm know. probably a little above that, but yeah. I like that. Me or you? Me. I think I'm yeah, I know. I'd say you're like a little me. bit. I'd say you're above me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Appreciate that. I feel you. I feel you got a lot of good things going. Um, and you're like what six five, six seven, <laughs> six nine. Yeah. 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 Like every time I see this guy, he like grows. It's crazy. Yeah. And I'm also like fit. It's fuck. Look at that. Jacked. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. All right. We have anything else? We good? That's that's all I got. Watch on this movie. Watch my special. Yeah. Okay. Let's do your plugs real quick. Oh, like plug myself in? Well, because I want to give Trevor's done it four times, but I want to give him one more, <laughs> one more fucking chance to do it. No, no, no. Uh, okay, uh, go watch my new film Divinity. It's out in theaters now, and it's going to be coming out um, to Apple TV um, for streaming in, uh, December twelfth. That's great. Yeah, and my IG is Emily Wallace X three, and my Twitter is Emily Wallace XOXO. Okay. Before and you... I'm on, and I'm, I, and I do have an OF. Hold up. Wait, before you go. What's and what's this? on that OF? <laughs> yeah. What's Bloopers. Coming... Crazy. Bloopers shit. from the movies. Yeah, behind the scenes. What's coming what up? What type of scenes? What... Behind my scenes. December twelfth is behind the scenes. Uh no, December twelfth is Divinity comes out in Apple TV. On Apple TV. Okay, I'm gonna be running out of theater, he, or maybe a stadium. I'm gonna be running out actually so far. So like, comment, subscribe. I'm gonna pick sixty thousand people to come and watch it. Uh, Trevor, go ahead. I just have my special on Amazon Prime, yeah. Prime Video, okay. November fourteenth. It's called right. Pterodactyl. Go check it out. Go check it out, and then obviously like, comment, subscribe. One night with Stiney. We're right below Joe Rogan on the rankings. And uh, nice. Thank you guys both for coming on. What do you got coming up? Just these podcasts every week. Yeah. Yeah. That's but like, fun. also a lot of other things in the works. That I don't want to share. That are gonna <laughs> <Yeah>. fucking cry. <laughs> blow the fuck wow. up. They're gonna take you to be seven foot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, that's it. Thank you guys so much. Bye, guys. Thank you. All right.